So I have gone out into the world because I was going crazy at home. And Los Angeles 405 is the busiest freeway, I think, in the world. No traffic, no traffic. I'm just zipping up and down, zipping up and down with nothing to do. But what I've realized is that it's the new normal for now. So I need y'all to use this time wisely. Don't mess this time off because I don't know how long this going to last. Spend the time with the family. Get to know your kids' names. Like I learned Joshua's full name today. I was like, oh, that's what I named you, okay? So I'm encouraging you to spend time with your family. What's really crazy is I'm in the house with my baby daddy's girlfriend too. She's staying with us and her dog. Fantastic. See, y'all probably tripping like, oh, that's crazy. No, it's absolutely wonderful. I see how they was living in Africa. I see how they was making it because we splitting up the responsibilities, cooking and she watching the kids while I'm in the streets right now. I did some laundry. Uh, she done played some Uno. Yeah, I can't play no more Uno. And then when I get back, me and her gonna watch TV together. See, it's the new normal. It's making life different because on normal circumstance, would we be doing that? No, we would not be doing that. Um, no, we wouldn't be doing it. So uh, I'm just saying, embrace whatever's happening. It's going to be a lot of babies in December because I think that it's going to be a lot of Corona babies because people ain't got nothing to do. People sit in their house and they, they're going to do the nasty. I know it. So December, January, a bunch of babies going to come out. Uh, don't name them Corona, please. Um, I know that uh, I was thinking of booty calls and I was like, you really can't have no booty calls. I'm going to tell y'all, don't do that. Unless you done got one of them little kits from the CDC that you can swab somebody when they come in and test them. You can't have no booty calls. I mean, you just, just got to be lonely. Get on social media like me and talk to the people and then you have friends. Um, let's see. What else was I going to tell y'all about? Um, oh, I think, I think I've, I've, I've covered it all because I wanted to run down some things. Oh, the CDC. I did have to say that. The CDC said that they are going to um, maybe suggest or something. Take the kids out of school for eight or 18 days. Something crazy. I think it was 18. 18 days. 18. No. Weeks. That's what it was. Eight. It was eight. Excuse me, y'all. It was 18 weeks. Let me tell you something, CDC. Unless y'all gonna get some child care, some food for these children, and some activities, you about to make it a real pandemic. That's what it's gonna be. These parents can't be with their children for no 18 weeks. What we gonna teach them, huh? We don't know the stuff. We don't know that new math and nothing like that. Ain't nobody teaching each other. You know what, Joshua? We're gonna know some jokes. I'm gonna be teaching Joshua how to be a stand up. That's it. That's all I got. I'm driving, but I'm watching the road. All right? So, y'all, I know I keep peeking my head in. But that's all we got, CDC. So, don't do that. But right now, I'm gonna suggest to everybody stay in the house. It is, it, it, it is a mess. Listen to what the people say. Get to know your family. Joshua hugged me three, four times a day. He was so excited that I was home, not on my phone, and playing Uno and doing family stuff. So, you know, God does things for a reason. So this might be a time when we all are supposed to really get to know each other and stop running in the rat race. Maybe that. I know I ain't supposed to be in the streets because I'm in the streets right now. It, it'll, yeah, I'm going to go home. All right, y'all. I'm going to tell y'all what happens tomorrow. It's the first day of Corona Diary.